Hello, hello, my beloved waking gods and goddesses. Welcome to Love, Truth, and Beauty. Do it yourself, spiritual awakening for divine in the flesh. Now with replays on IGTV at Dakini.kiss, where together we learn how to surf and navigate the ups and downs of the totality of human experience, creating a new earth beyond the limitations of this perception managed reality matrix of five senses, having discovered our true divine creative natures in our true sensual sensorial universe of seven senses composing formless into form outside of the matrix in the true quantum field creation field universe before we get started please do give this video a thumbs up please also hit the subscribe button and the notification bell selecting the all setting so that when i upload videos the youtube will let you know i generally upload tuesdays and fridays 2 p.m eastern my name is mario west and i am your hostess of the highest here to download upload inspire and usher you into your best descent brightest selves, your bestest and brightest light, and inviting you all to open your hearts wider and wider and wider still. Hello, my honey bunnies. <laughs> How goes it there? How goes it there, you waltzers in and out of the matrix? Oh yeah, I know what you guys are up to. That's way cool, by the way. Uh, welcome to Love, Truth, and Beauty, episode 217. And today I want to address the ongoing process of integrating, integrating, pardon me, and unifying the masculine and feminine within as the first step crucial toward deactivating the in the matrix trauma-based mind control programs of the divide and conquer war of the sexist shit show that has been promulgated and imposed upon humanity by the powers that want to be over the many millennia of our human history okay now if you cannot see the blatant fuckery of the powers that want to be and their divisive trigger happy controls over us to get us to fight one another between men and women male female the various gender divides with all of the different fucking pronouns that we have to memorize and such toxic femininity and toxic masculinity of man hating woman hating polarities now y'all don't get butt hurt as i make this plain dare i say you are sound asleep you are not paying attention because you are too enmeshed in their bullshit controls and lack the self-awareness to notice you're being manipulated. Wake up, people. I'm not joking. Stop being a tool for them, okay? All divide and conquer programs of the powers that want to be can only be deactivated from the inside out, my friends. Okay, this means that every one of us, we must deal with and heal our relationship between the masculine action taking within and the feminine being within all of us, regardless of our gender, regardless of whether we're male or female, get over that shit, okay? Now, in that integration, integration and incorporation, we can all take full responsibility for all our traumas of the past that trigger us, thus healing the great divide within. Doesn't that sound wonderful? We can all do this, okay? So doing so requires examining our respective daddy issues and our respective mommy issues within our respective tribal lineages. That is our family of origin. Now, remember, it only takes one fully awakened conscious person in any tribal lineage on either side to heal and deactivate the great divide throughout all timelines and all lineages in all directions, okay? So that is no more hand-me-down tribal dysfunction and codependent automated enslavement for the powers that want to be, 
right? To control us. Everyone has equal access to all the laws of the universe. And the elite families that populate the powers that want to be are banking on our willful ignorance to remain ignorant and stuck in the belief that only highborn special people have access to this occulted knowledge. Okay, they occulted it for a reason. They don't want us regular folk to know. So know that that whole notion that you have to be special and highborn, it's all a big fat fucking lie. Okay, stop the internal battles. Check yourselves okay the feminine within both women and men is the part of us who receives information and inspiration whether we're receiving it through our heart through the download through our seventh chakra okay the masculine within both men and women male or female is the part of us that takes action or stands steadfast until action is truly required and inspired okay the masculine within is the action taker and giver did you hear that the masculine within is the action taker and giver the feminine within is the receiver, the allower. Note that because masculine energy is the giver, that is energy that flows from within outward toward another person or a cause outside oneself. Nurturing, for example, is not an expression of feminine energy but an expression of action oriented masculine energy so mommying and daddying masculine energy okay now even the term bitch points to a woman or feminine like man expressing outwardly projective whiny masculine energy and we tend to not want to receive such energies am i right okay now conversely a more feminine expressing man or woman is often called a pussy a wimp or in uh new age terms the sensu that sensitive new age guy or gal okay don't hate me don't hate me this is all in poop i mean pop culture okay Feminine energy, I repeat, is the receiver. Receive and allows, brings in energy from the outside of oneself. The feminine is magnetic. The masculine is electric. Okay, this is the yin-yang of it all. We often say shit like, grow a pair of cojones, grow a pair of balls, please. I know I've done it. I've done it when I have felt frustrated and felt thwarted by the matrix shit shows where men or women stay in cowardice rather than defaulting to courage and bravery and standing up for themselves i've also said to my brothers um during my old days of still operating at the edge of sexist mind control maybe if you grew a pair of boobs grew a vagina and gave birth you'd be more of a gentleman. Blah, blah, blah. So bearing in mind the credo, you spot it, you got it. The next time you diss a woman or a man by name calling or judging or hating or not owning your triggers and projecting it onto them, note that you ought to check yourself. You are only harming your inner self, your inner masculine and inner feminine, okay? They both want your respect. They are your inner teammates that actually animate and activate and actualize your life and your creation. So bear that in mind. The sacred marriage of the inner feminine and inner masculine, also known as the heros gamos, is an in side job you heal this inner divide and watch your relationships transform and elevate to the heart-based new humanity my loves 
the great inner work requires each of us to pull back and own every outward projection onto another and onto the world populating the matrix we don't want to do that so we need to verify within our own status regarding whatever judgment or trigger or criticism or whatever we're projecting onto another onto the world at large which as i just said grows the matrix shit shows okay now by doing so doing the great work we learn to utilize all of our triggers of emotion, of thought, of physical discomfort, or whatever, memory as gateways to waking the fuck up, exiting the matrix, and all its divide and conquer mind control programs. And guess what? We embody the heart-based new humanity. Okay, my love bugs, that is my speech. We will continue to unpack and get more intimate with the new relationship template of the heart-based new humanity residing in the true quantum field creation field universe. Please help me grow my channel by giving this video a thumbs up and leaving a comment in the comment box below or in private yes i am holding back some comments i've added keywords so uh when i get to them they will be published as long as they're not naughty please share this video with your community's friends family members and on social media platforms you feel would benefit from my creations please hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell selecting the all setting so that the youtube will let you know when i upload next and if you find value enjoy benefit or are at least entertained by my work my videos won't you please consider supporting my work through a donation my paypal link is right below as is is my link tree that hooks you up with all my stuff and the many different ways you can connect with me work with me also we have a launch coming up love truth and beauty.com and the new marios.com is about to launch i think we're gonna do it next week two 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 whatever i don't know i don't know if we're gonna do it that way new moon at least okay i thank you all so much for hanging out with me with your participation and focus attention i really do appreciate it i cannot do this without you and i do this for you for all of us so until next time my love bugs always act from love outside in the matrix from your center screen composing a new reality, up-leveling, quantum jumping, all our lifelines. That's right. Let's go higher and higher and higher so that we can all be the love that we are. We can share our love. We can create. We can make art, make music, make love. And you can all help me repopulate the true quantum field, creation field universe. So here's two love truth and beauty my beautiful waking gods and goddesses divine in the flesh Mwah!